Well, this has been a very, very long turn, and I've been puzzling this one for some time. Um, the only thing I'd like to do, um, in addition to what I've already done, well, two things. I'd like to use my spies better, but um, I, I, I've decided to move this army. Um, I, this army is going to go for the furthest point, which is this one over here, and take a risk. Yep. And this guy here is going to start looking at places just to find out what's going on because I'd, I'd really like to know um, how many troops the enemy have got in places such as these so I don't think that's going to get in my way is it so let's go and have a look I don't think it is okay I'm going to stop their movement for now though so it doesn't happen on the turn end because I don't want them getting in the way of them and causing extra problems. Okay, so he's going to go that way. Um, these guys here, these are going to go this way, but they can't do it yet, of course. Uh, they're going to be backed up by some troops from here, and then I'm thinking about maybe bringing some troops back, but I need to sort all these out and get them all um, replenishing and stuff. And there's a port as well that's damaged somewhere that I found somewhere, so I need to deal with that. So, Okay, so that, that's those moves. They're really the only ones that I'm concerned about at the moment, but, like I said, the agents. Gentlemen, 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 orthodox, orthodox, not so thoughtful about that. Let's start at the bottom. This one here. Is in, he's in the Crimea. So I think we need to move him somewhere. Uh, he is in quite a good position for watching anything that might be coming this way. But I can't see anything in this area at the moment anyway. So, But having said that, I can't really see wherever else he's going to go because he's going to get there well after the armies get there anyway, isn't he? So I really don't know. You see, these guys... They've already moved, haven't they? So I can't move those. Um, right, let's go back to him then. Here he is, Crimea. Let's get him moving at least in the right direction for these places so we can see what's in them. I don't know how long it's going to take me to do all of this. Which way is he going to go? You know, in terms of on this turn. You see, they're going to fall pretty quickly. I, th I hope they're going to fall fairly quickly as well. Um, I think maybe we'll head generally in that direction. Okay, next one. Uh, Afghanistan. Oh, he's miles away from anywhere. I don't care about him. I'll leave him. Flanders. He's miles away. Lombardy, again, a long way away. Another one in the Crimea. So let's have him, I don't know, perhaps going up here somewhere. Um... And then, where were we? Flanders, that was crime. It's Savoy. Where's that? I don't know. Let's go and have a look. Ah, now, that might be able to go somewhere useful. So let's have him perhaps up here then. Doesn't really matter. It's just willy-nilly. I just want to expose any armies that might attack me. Anything that might get into my way, that's the thing. France, not interested. Muscovy. Is that Muscovy? I've got a rake in... Where? Where are you? Where are you? It's this one, isn't it? Right. Okay, well... Again... I don't know where I'm going to send them. Like I said, it doesn't matter much, does it? Let's get him over that way. He might show what's in there, or any other forces that are around. Um, Transylvania. Now these, um, they're, all, they're just converting places, aren't they, anyway? So I'll leave him. In fact, I'm going to leave all of those and just use my spies for now. Okay, so th that's it, really. Um, I'm a bit frustrated by... Where are they? Um, another army. That's these in here. I'm going to say a bit frustrated. I'm very frustrated by these. Um, because basically they're just doing nothing there. Um... Uh, really, I can't even move to these places. There's no point in moving to those places. So, I think what I'll do is I'll, I'll bring them over to here. Because at least they're going to be able to attack the Russians when the time comes, aren't they? I think that's probably the best way to do it. Okay, bring those over to here. 
Is the place happy? Yes, it is. We are going to have to attack the Russians at some point, of course. Now, I was recruiting loads and loads of troops in here, wasn't I, as well? I don't think I really need any more. Um, not if I bring these over, I don't, do I? Uh, no, I think I've got enough of them. Mind you, they're only Dragoons, aren't they? But having said that, when we attack, it's not going to be anything... Nah, no, I'm, I'm just going to get rid of that. There's no point. Right, OK, 509 I now have. So I now have more money to spend. So let's spend that. I think it was this army, wasn't it? Where else was looking poor? 19, 19, 44, 45, 23, 92, 73 is low. OK, and 92 is fairly low. 187 left. These are the ones I was doing before, of course, and wasn't able to continue. So I do the 30-something? 67 left. Not much there left now. Just these, perhaps. 45. There must be one that's very close. Um, 1,600, 1,600. Looks like I'm doing everybody now, doesn't it, actually? In fact, I think that's it. I think they're actually all covered now. Yeah, I think so. Well, with only 45 left in the bag, I don't think I'm going to be able to do anything else, so I, we'll call it a day at that. Well, let's finally do this turn end. Uh, the, like I said on the previous video, it seems to have been really lasting a great deal of time, this video. Ah, now those will be those trade ships that I captured, weren't they? I, I, you know, it's been so long, I've forgotten where I was sending them to. Hmm. Lots of... Um, good feedback about my um, commentary, the seal knot commentary at the weekend actually, which I'm very pleased about. Um, one of the board members at the seal knot said to me that um, that he could see a career in front of me, so you know, um, that may well mean that I get asked to do more in the future. I mean, it sounds like I'm getting asked to do them all, doesn't it? But I, I don't expect that's the case. Trade agreement, trade agreement. Um, okay, refuse offer, because they want um, a territory off me, and they're not going to damn well get it, are they? Right, I'm hoping at the top there, in the north Swedish um, regions... Oh look! Uh, little army's messing around, isn't it? Um, I, I, I'm hoping to go in with the army that I've got nearby, um, but also to back it up with um, a few units, like, um, well, guns, for instance, from the army in St. Petersburg there, so uh, just to make it easier to to capture the place. So, I, I, I forget how many regions there were. Four, or something? Four Swedish regions? Shouldn't be too hard to capture those, should it? Right, OK. Enemy raid, Smolensk. That's that one I just looked at, wasn't it? There. Well, I'll repair it anyway. It might just attract him. Make him want to come and attack, it, attack there again. I can't see anywhere where he's going to go, really. But the biggest threat to me is here, isn't it? So I might need to leave some troops behind, which is not going to be a problem for me, is it, really? Did he leave these here, wherever they are, or were? Uh, over here, over here, there. He's sitting pretty there, isn't he? It's a strong position, that, you know. I want to bypass it if I can, because uh, I see no reason not to. Um, right, OK. Now, I can get back to there in time. He can't reach there in one turn. Because he'll have guns in there. Uh, see, he can't reach. Which means that, that I've got time to um, recruit in here if I really want and need to. But I, I will do, actually. Oh, no, I won't. I'm not recruiting that rubbish. I'm going to risk it. I'm going to risk not having anybody there. Um, and continue in my journey. I, I might just get these out of the way first, though. Uh, over to perhaps there. Oh, is there anybody else in my way? Let's go and have a look. You over to here. No one else from what I can see in the way there. Okay, good. It's going to take him um, two turns to reach to here. I could probably intercept him anyway if he comes this way. Um, I might be able to reach the capital in around about the same time as him. Even if not, if he takes it, I'll be able to take it straight back off him, won't I? So I'm, I'm really not worried. Shall, shall I get somebody in here, though? Um, just so that we've made the effort, I suppose. Um, yeah, OK, let's get some... What are these? Cossack infantry, 7030, 765. 
Um, 7025. I'm going to get the Cossacks. Yeah. You see, the Cossacks will um, fight better on the walls. Oh, that's what I'm thinking anyway. Workers on strike. Uh, Muscovy, but I don't think that's going to be a problem. It isn't a problem, is it? Because we repaired the buildings, but I'll just repair these as well. Uh, army, maybe? No, they're the ones that are all being done already. Uh, there are probably buildings in here that I need to do something about, actually, so shall I have a look at those now? Maybe. Yeah, just that one. Uh, and I'll turn it into a church as usual. Uh, church school. Okay, good. Hey, that reminds me. I think I'll just check on my tech. I haven't looked at it for a while. <laughs> Maybe it's because I've not been moving the troops, have I? I've, uh, sorry, not, not been moving through the turns. Ah, now him. I need him out of the way so that I can see what I'm doing. Okay, yeah, you can come up to here somewhere. Uh, I see nothing there, is there? No, 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 nothing guarding bridges or anything. Well, I can bring that army out of there. I'm not too sure exactly where I'm going to take it yet and what I'm going to do with it. Um, that's the place that's been attacked, isn't it? So, presumably, if, if he can attack there, he can also come back and attack up there, can't he? Hmm. Okay, food for thought. I might just leave some some troops in there. You know, just say, leave about four units or something. This is the principal attack. This is what I really need to resolve on this one. Um, he could go up there. Do I really need to? I think so, actually. Let's take him up to there. And then when he goes up there, he should... No, I don't want you in the place. I just want you near the place. You should show me if there are any other troops around. No, nothing at all. The Swedes are just completely had it, haven't they, really? I think they've fallen apart. I could probably get a piece with them now if I wanted to. Um, on very good terms. Well, you'd expect it, wouldn't you, if diplomacy was working as well as it ought to do in this game, really. Right, OK, we're in there. And continue siege. He's got... Um, what, what did he have? I didn't quite notice. Take account of it there. He's building this up, look. He's building a royal palace. Uh, that's because this is his capital, of course, but... He's not going to get his Royal Palace, and nor am I, because I'm not going to wait five turns for it. OK, he's got 17 units. Um, six of them are just these guys. Not very good. The, this, 24-pounder, they are good artillery. So it's not going to be an easy task, that one, is it? Um, well, let's um, bring over, I don't know, certainly the guns, and perhaps some horse with the guns. Mind you, have got plenty of horse in here, haven't I? Three horse in there. Um, do I need to take some horse out of here? One, two, well, three horse in here. I shouldn't need to, should I? Okay, well, let's give them the guns. And uh, perhaps a couple of units of infantry. I, don't, I think that should do it, to be honest. Mind you, maybe we're going to go on from there and attack somewhere else. Let me just see how quickly they can get from here to there because it might be this army that's attacking up here next one two uh, yeah it's going to be three turns isn't it to get there but it does look as though they're the most likely to continue that attack doesn't it so okay um i'm just wondering what else i do with this army anyway i mean i could put them on boats because they're near enough to the coast aren't they so maybe that's what i need to do just use it. I've got too many armies, basically. See, that army is going to move up to the northeast there. This army is going to come across this way to the east. This army is already going northeast. So, and there are only um, four places to take anyway. That one's about. Oh no! Hang on. One, two, three, four. There are five. That one's about to fall. That one's two turns later. This one's about three turns. I think they're all about three, four turns away, aren't they? Before it's all gone. But I can't really see any point in launching more than these two armies, that one up there, and then, yeah, okay, let's do that then, let's have, um, which we have, the two guns, certainly, actually, they've got a general, have they, I'll give them a general in a minute, that's probably the best way, okay, one, two, and then, what, a couple of infantry units, maybe give them one of the lights, actually, just to fire up at the walls, and perhaps uh, a grenadier unit as well. 
Um, yeah, just in case we need to storm somewhere. I don't think we will. Right, okay. Okay, well, I'm just going to go in and do this. Um, basically because there's no point in, in showing this battle. Oh, I will, however, give them a general. Right, okay. Uh, right, okay, these are going to come on as reinforcements. Like I said, in fact, I tell you what, I'm going to bring these on. Bring them up. There's no reason not to, you know, because it's just... I've actually, it might be worth me trying this. Oh, look! <laughs> they can get in there. Oh, he can't! Ah, oh, madness. Total madness. Oh, I don't know what's going on there, anyway. But only one gun now needs to get into position. So, oh, in fact, I might just go through these. Workers on the strike, Muscovy. Yep, we know about that, and they're all happy now. Let's demand also, Muscovy. No worries there. Recruitment report. Ah, thank you very much. New France, New France. Ah, that's Quebec, isn't it? Maybe I need to do something with Quebec as well. Like, go and attack some Indians. Where's this? Um, hmm. Okay. Just a... A general defensive thing, that, I think. Right, units recruited. Yep, New France. Construction report. Okay, very good. Um, what about that? Maybe in Panama I need to upgrade the roads. Trouble is, we're so near to the end of the game now. Is there really any point spending money on such things? I don't think there is, really. Okay, uh, enemy raid. That's that one that I've already repaired. And I'm going to... Mm, I don't know if I'll leave that on there or not. Just so I know that I need to pay attention to him. I'm half hoping I can leave enough troops behind here um, in various places to defend them so that I can just wipe out the Swedes and then he'll just vanish. That's the general plan. OK, I'll ignore that one then. Uh, right, ah, oh, one thing I will do though, while I'm still thinking about it, because I may well forget otherwise. Oh look, we're getting this now as well. Just make sure that all my universities are actually researching useful things. Uh, what's that? Percussion cap, or percussion shells. Uh, tell you what, it might be nice to have some uh, rockets before the game ends. I've got quite a few videos before that happens, by the way, but... Right, classical economics that needs, and is classical economics on its way? 3, 13 for abolition of slavery. I don't think that's ever going to happen, is it? Um, anything that's just on one... That's on four. That's on seven. There isn't, is there? One, two, three, four, five. Four, five. OK, well, I'm going to leave it at that then, because um, I don't really see any point in doing anything else. They're researching everything that I need, so... Um, ah, now, maybe I need to move some more agents out of my way. Perhaps I should look at those first before... Well, I'm already committed now anyway, aren't I? So I suppose it makes that much difference. These have moved on even further. Ukraine. Uh, I really don't see any point, you know. No, I'm, I'm just going to leave them. I've asked them to move where I want them to go anyway. So, I, OK, I'm just going to go off, um, uh, off screen for what will be a second to you while I just wipe these guys out. I'm sure I've got enough here in this force to easily do this. Um, um, actually, let me just see if I can try that one more time. Sometimes you never know your luck, dear. No, this time I do. Uh, demand surrender. Refused. OK, right, I'll show you the results. Back in a second, folks. Well, I have one of those particularly vicious... I might even show a bit of this, actually. Um, a vicious mortar um, battery, which is around here somewhere. I ended up throwing some horse in there to try and get rid of it. Um, he also had a pretty indestructible... It's not going to show me now. Um, anyway, uh, end battle on that. A uh, pretty indestructible cavalry unit. I didn't realise his units had 60 in them. So I charged three lots of horse... Um, through three of his gates, having opened them by putting some grenadiers on the walls, so that gave all the gates to me, after I'd destroyed all his infantry, of course. I then charged with three units of horse against his horse, but he had 60 
in his horse. He managed to hit one of my units first, which by then was a bit tired, routed it. The second one went into his flank. He was routing that one when the third arrived. So I have pretty damn good, really, I think. I uh, still only lost 134, which is not bad for 1100, is it, really? So oh, I'm not going to complain about that one. Uh, and it's all mine, so let's um, sort that one out. Can he actually get in there? It's worth a try, isn't it? No, he can't. Weird how one can and the other one can't, isn't it? But there you go. I'm not going to moan about that one again. How much is this going to cost me? 1,253. That wasn't cheap, was it, that victory? Never mind. Let's see what else is in here, shall we? Um, yeah, oh, I want to get rid of that. Um, the Divinity Place, whatever you call it. Uh, actually, I've just had a thought. Maybe... Uh, oh, yeah! <laughs> Look! Um, I was going to say, maybe I can get a troop-carrying ship around there, but... Um, do you know what I mean? And then filter troops around. Have I got any? There aren't any other ports around there, though, are there? So I don't think I'd be able to do it anyway. I was just thinking about a quick way to get into here, but I think, to be honest with you, by the time I've moved all my ships around, I'll be there anyway. So it's just not worth it, is it? So, right, okay, they have to come out of there and move up to there and find out what he's doing. Can he move? Not yet. I'm hoping he hasn't got many men in there. I certainly don't expect that he will have. And, do you know, that's taken so long. It took probably a couple of hours. That's because I was doing other things and having a cup of tea and... <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> horses. Uh, sorry, horse is still a bit of voice. Voice is still a bit of horse on the weekend. Um, getting a bit ahead of myself there with words. Uh, yeah, we're trusting him, aren't we, not to do anything. Um, yeah, I'm tempted to go for the Ruskies, but um, not quite yet. He's almost there. So he can take out that place when the time comes. It's going to happen because, well, I don't know. Um, I can't be having him in my back, really, can I? It just doesn't really make too much sense, does it? He's on his... Ah, he's almost there, actually. Well, let's put him in there, then. Okay. So we're now in a position to wipe out the Russians there. And wipe out the Russians here. Cool, we've got generals all over the place, haven't we? Right, okay, and then I've got a large army. Is it here? Yes, it's here. Um, who's going to go where? Right, okay, I've, he's now got four territories. Let's have a look. One, two, three, four. I've got one army on its way there if he remains unharassed by those at the bridge. So that's these. Um, he's going to take... Oh, actually, yeah, that one. He's going to take two turns from here. Then I've got one on their way here. They're going to take two turns. Uh, I could move these inland, but where to? Is there really a point? They're the ones I thought, well, I'll send them out with the ships. I'm wondering about anybody else being in reach. Now, there was someone who was fairly close, and I can't find him now. The one who damaged the Pleasure Gardens. He's around somewhere. Ha! Now, these, do I need them? Do I really need them out of here? Ah, now, can he move? No. No, okay. Can any of these move? No, they're all in the way. I think... I, I don't know. You see, he's going up that way. He's going that way. Do I really need someone else? to go across the centre. He's going to take, what, how many turns? It's only going to take two to get there. Might be worth it, you know, actually. He's going to take two to get there. How long will it take to get from there to there afterwards? Just wondering. If it, actually, I might as well get him on the way back. Or he can pick him up. Oh, I don't know. I really don't know. Uh, leave some infantry behind. That's the main thing. Or do I just recruit some? Because I don't think any... Th any well, he's in reach. He could attack me with those three units. Shall I just leave three infantry behind? Yeah, OK. Leave the better ones. So we take these. Or do I just fill it up with here? They can't reach, can they? No. 
Okay, now I'll leave three behind. So we'll select all of these and then leave him and him and him. Three infantry units really ought to be enough to defend it against that load of rubbish there, shouldn't it? So, right, okay, um, where am I going? He's going to go and take that one. This one is going to take either this one or that one. And I suspect this unit that I'm sending here is going to be in a position to take that one anyway. Uh, I think I'll go for the furthest one. I'm going to go for this. Because this is the most mobile army I've got, and I can be there in two turns. So let's do that then. Okay, good. I really don't think I need to recruit in here. Can those that were at the bridge get me? I don't think they can, can they? Right, okay, well, I think that's about it for Europe. I want to move on so we can get through the turns. I do want to get my ships into the ports so that I can start repairing them. Um, there's nothing here that can threaten me anymore. So let's get these guys to, oh, I don't know, as far over as I can, really. Perhaps over to, perhaps an empty port if I can find one. I think I filled them all up, didn't I? Uh, any empty ports around here? There's one there. That's not mine. Okay. Um, uh, nothing. Not that I can see. Okay, well, let's go over to here then. And um, repair them in here. T to be honest, I don't think I'm going to need them again, but. You know, just in case, so, yep, that was damn expensive, and these guys on here, do I take that Dragoon off there? I, I might as well just leave him in there, to be honest with you, he's, he's hardly costing me anything. Um, uh, these, though, could do with repair, probably. Um, bring them over to... they don't really look like they need any repair, do they? In fact... Uh, damaged ships to use repair for each. Select the damaged ships. Ah, right, okay, I haven't selected them yet. Um, what's that? 13. They do not need repair, do they? Do you know, I'm going to leave those there because that's a pretty decent position for those ships to be in. Let's leave them. And then these. I don't know if they need repair either. They don't look it, do they? Nope, they don't need repair either. So let's add those then to this rather magnificent fleet of first rates to beat off any Poles or Prussians if they um, get a little bit above themselves. Um, anybody else? Surely these need to be... Yeah, they need it, don't they? Um, I wonder... Maybe I'll just repair those in there, actually. No, actually not. Let's bring them out here. No, actually, no, I might need... I, I'll bring them out to here. Yeah, I might need them. At the moment, I'm using them to block up this channel. But I think those troops are going to be right to come out of there fairly soon. So let, let's just repair these then for now. I know it's expensive, but uh, 1,381, we do seem to have plenty of money at the moment, so I think that's going to be in my favour. Anything else that I can build around here? Yeah, I think I can get a church in there, can't I? Church school. Well, let's see how, how happy everything is. Regions. Green, 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 green. Everything green, everything green, everything green there. OK, good. Uh, quick look over to the Americas and then we'll do a turn end. I want to see if I can wipe out the Swedes on this video, if it's at all possible. I think we're OK around here. I might just recruit up in Canada. See if I can, I don't know, at least deter any attacks by Indians. I don't know. Maybe I should just go for trade with them in the hope that I can hold it here. But I think... Uh, they're quite big actually, aren't they there? What can I recruit in here? Not much. Well, let's recruit in here then. I I'll just take precautions then, you know, against anybody that might attack me. See, that's all I've got in there, isn't it? Infrastructure is good. Recruitment. Uh, 
what do we get? Buckle guns? We get. <laughs> I bet they don't like rockets. Um. Yeah, I bet buckle guns are good against them. You know, actually, the Indians. It's probably why they have got Gatling guns, isn't it, in this area? Household cavalry. I can't get them, but I can get General's bodyguard. Ah, colonial dragoons. I bet they don't like those, do they? I have to get light dragoons because I don't think I, I don't think I can get anything else. Um, I bet you they don't fight very well hand to hand. Six thirteen seven, and these are seven seven seven. So they don't have a good melee defence. Not good things against Indians, I don't think. So let's get some of these then. Okay, so buckle guns, yeah, that could be quite fun, couldn't it? Uh, actually, I'll get one buckle gun and I'll get something else. What else should I get? I'll get a range weapon. 24 pound of foot artillery. Hey, hang on a minute, how come that's taking me two turns? These only take. Does it just take two anyway, that one? Rockets. I'm thinking about some. Uh, rockets. Do I get rockets? No, because they don't move, do they? Um, I think. Yeah, okay, I'll get those then. Right. Okay, yeah, I think that should just about do it, shouldn't it? And then over here. Anything in there? I construct something. Might as well, because I can. Um, I don't want to recruit anything in there. Risk this. What about a bit of trade with the in engines? See what happens. Uh, Denmark, Gran Canaria. I, th I thought that. Oh, that's Iceland, isn't it? Of course. Hanover. Not trading with them either. Where are the Indians? Plains nation. I can't trade with any of those. Why can't you trade with Indians? They did a lot of trading with Indians, didn't they? Gran Canaria, Colombia. No, I don't want to strengthen them and I don't want them to see my territories. I don't want Hanover to either. Uh, yeah, I don't know, not even Denmark. No, I'm not going to risk it. OK, right, turn end. Let's see what else happens. don't think there's anybody else. I, think I might just take out the Russians next turn. Um, yeah, OK. Let's see what happens. See which way he goes. It's almost tempting, isn't it, to just blast through a load of auto resolves, isn't it? You know, just to um, finish the Swedes off and finish the Russians off. I could just cram completely into the middle of Europe and squash out whatever's left in there, which is, I don't know, Hanoverians, Prussians and Poles. Oh, what's this? Trade agreement? No, you're not having anything from me. Um, you should be asking for a trade agreement with no terms attached you Russians after what I've done for you throughout the whole of this game that's interesting isn't it the um, uh, I don't know politics isn't it I'm thinking about the uh, the Russians um, giving um, free um, wait, what is it? Oh, I, don't, I don't know. Transport passage, I suppose, is the best way to describe it, isn't it? To this um, Snowden chap. Ah, declared war. Oh, that's a bit unfriendly, isn't it? Uh, no, I'm not going to tie the Poles and Russians into that one. That doesn't make any sense at all. So who am I at war with? The Iroquois. I wonder where the Iroquois are. Ah, right, they're up in the north. <laughs> they're worried about my mobilisations, that's what it is. Ah. Yeah, it's funny, you wonder how military access, military alliance, they're offering a military alliance for a military alliance and technology. They want money. Get lost. Get lost. I'll take a military alliance, but there's no way I'm going to pay you for an alliance. I know I've got loads and loads of money, but I can fight these Indians off by myself. They're coming to Quebec. I've got loads of troops around there. I'm only defending two territories. Ah, on the other hand... Are the Iroquois... What's that? How many turns until... Four turns until surrender. Well, that's not going to make any difference to me, because... Have I got all those troops? No. I've got these troops in here. Yeah, and I'm not replenishing, am I? So, uh, four t in four turns, you're going to be dead, boy. You know, so I wouldn't worry at all about that one. <laughs> Um, well, you are going to worry, but, uh, right, um, do, do, oh, I, I think they're fine. 
don't need to do anything else with that. City besieged, Moscow, yes we know, thank you very much. Uh, construction report, wow, 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 lots and lots of things. Okay, let's go and have a look over here then and see wherever else we can attack. There must be somewhere we can go, oops, that's where we're heading, isn't it? And this is where we are, over here, right, this is where we are. Right, okay, um, damn, it's going to take ages, isn't it? How long is it going to take for me to get over there? Let's move him out of the way first and see what we've got. Gosh, he's moving slowly as well, isn't he? Three turns it's going to take to get there. What a nuisance. Uh, but it's going to have to... I suspect it's because he's going around him. Okay, let's go this far then, see what happens. They're happy, good. There's no one that can attack them, good. Can he reach? Probably not. Nope, probably because they're going a little bit faster because they've got a general with them. I've no idea, but shall I recruit something in here just to make absolutely certain? There's nothing, is there? I can only get rubbish in there, so well, we're going to get some militia just to defend the walls. Why not? We've got loads of... I can only get one anyway. I should really just bring another unit from over here, shouldn't I? If I'm going to do anything with it. But I don't want to do anything with it, really. It's just a waste of time. Here, what's this? Wow, look at that. Steam-powered cloth mill. I've already got one, though, so I don't need any more in order to get the technology, do I? So, right, OK, I'll leave those there. I think maybe now is the time to attack the Russians, isn't it? Um... Yeah, OK, let's have a look over here. You can move where? Over to here? I don't know why I'm moving them over to there, because... Oh, it's here. Right. Nothing there. Well, one unit there. And what did they do here on the bridge? They stayed there. Excellent. And in here, I can't recruit anybody decent, can I? So this is where I want to bring up my... Russian tro my troops that are going to defeat the Russians. I want to defeat those there and then bring these up um, to help over here because I think they're going to need, well I know they're going to need reinforcements. So let's go in there and take this one then. Come on, where are you? Oh, I can't reach. Damn. I reached that one. No. He's got only one unit in there. Let me just stop that a minute and then go on to here. Right, OK. Can I reach? I think I can reach. Yes. He's got fortifications in there. He's, like I said, he's only got, like, what, two units in there. So let's go in there and get him. Is that going to be an auto-resolve, do you think? Well, demand surrender first. Refused. OK, I'm just going to auto-resolve this. There really is no point at this stage in the game. It lost only two, 22 casualties, so it was just not worth messing around, was it, really? OK, well, let's have a look in here. Um, College of Divinity, let's get rid of that one. And, OK. What else? Anything else? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Roads are good. All's well. And I think now I need to be moving these in this direction. And he's going to take, what, two moves to get there, we say? Two moves. And these here are going to take, um, also two moves, I imagine. That's one move. They're going to be there in one move. Maybe they'll get enough support from the artillery, though, when they're there. I'm really not too sure. It depends, really, on what those Swedes do that were up there at the bridge. Are they going to do anything silly? Right, OK. Uh, you guys can't go any further. You can't go any further. Um, so, I think that's about it again, isn't it? Is that it? Can I move anybody here in the middle? Um, do I want to move anybody here? No, I really want him to come and attack me, don't I, from there? Um, I thought I had another army which was bearing down in the centre of here somewhere. Is it this one? Yep. 
It's this one. Where's he going? He's going all the way up to there. Good. So, and he's coming down to this way, so... Yeah, I'll say, so, oh, I can take him. Probably. Oh, no! They're all moving the same speed, aren't they? I was just thinking, well, if they've got guns, then... In the way... Uh, oh, I can't quite... Re what a pain. Oh, what a nuisance. Ha! One more turn before we get there. But anyway, that's next turn, he's going to go. And he's going to go. So that's those two territories. And... Unfortunately, they're going to last for two turns, I think, which is a damn nuisance. But I don't know. I might just go in with infantry and see what happens. Um, I, I'm not going to replenish those. There's just no point, is there? I don't think so. I think we're going to take all these out before we need to replenish anybody. So I, actually, I will just the army on the top there that was doing um, that, that did that auto resolve. Would have. Oh no, actually they're okay, aren't they? Um, no, I'm not going to fuss about with that. I'm going to keep this army here just in case I need them against the Swedes anywhere. I really don't think I will. Um, but so that I can put them on a ship and get them out of the way. Right, OK, let's get rid of the Russians then. Um, because they've been a bit of a nuisance, haven't they, really? So, uh, I th they've just been a pain being at the back there, really. That's the thing. Um, ah, now, before I do that, let's just check which is the best one to go for. That's their capital. So that isn't going to surrender. This one here is going to surrender. Okay. Declare war. Yes. Uh, no, I'm not going to call anybody to help. I'm just going to finish them off. Let's hope nobody comes on their side as well. Hanover. Okay, Hanover, you're all going to die. Right. Okay. Yep, surrender accepted. I've been keeping the Russian Navy on my side, you see. That's what that's been all about. Um, uh, anything else in there? Uh, seminary. Actually, that's orthodox. The Russians are orthodox, aren't they? So I think that... What does it do? Converts to orthodox, and that's me. So I'll leave that one there. That's excellent, isn't it? OK, well, it means I've also got an army now that can go up there and relieve here, doesn't it? If he stays there. Which I very much doubt he's going to do. Or an army that could come here and help this place. Which one do I want to do? That's two turns away. I'm going to go this way to relieve this place and of course jump in on there if necessary how are we doing here everything seems so happy at the moment doesn't it plus one in there good now this is the place that wouldn't have surrendered anyway because it was um <sighs> oh got guns as well look at that uh yeah there's no way they're going to surrender um they've got settlement fortifications they're not improved one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is going to be a victory for me, but just to ensure that it is a victory for me, I'm going to go for it. It's well in my favour. There's no way I can... No, I can't lose that one. Surely can I? Do I risk it? Do I risk going for that one? I could just blow everybody away, but it would take forever, won't it, to fight it? No, I'm going to auto-resolve it. Victory. For 67 lost, or something like... Um, that was a big decision for me, that one, you know, because if it had gone the other way, I'd have been really peeved. Um, right, OK. Let's just replenish these then. Hey. All of them, please. Yes, thank you. Good. Now, anything in there that needs dealing with? In here, do do do, seminary. Right, that one converts to orthodox. Excellent. Good, and that one will as well then. OK, no universities to worry about, so we're OK in there as well. I don't know if I need to come out of there and maybe relieve this siege up here, but no, I don't want to. I want him to come and attack me, really. That's the best thing, isn't it? Um, anyway, he's all going to die, aren't they? They're, they are all going to die, rather, not he are all going to die. So, right, OK, let's come over here then and see um, what these Iroquois... Ah, what I really want to do... Let's see if the Iroquois can attack anywhere like Newfoundland, because I don't want that to happen. Um, I'll just get another couple of units in there. Yeah, OK, take two turns, but who cares. What are they? Oh, they're OK, they're Inuit. So I'm happy with those. It's just these Iroquois, isn't it, that are going to be a bit of a pain. Um, the Iroquois have got two territories as well, so if I take one, I've got to then go on and take the other one as well. I think I'll wait for him to come for me. I'm pretty safe, carefree. 
construction well it's not built yet but that's not an issue for me I don't think right okay um, recruit more why not let's have a mighty army in here can do let's see how they like rockets that should be fun shouldn't it general's bodyguard uh, maybe I should have another general actually and what more infantry two three three yeah okay I don't know how many horse I've got there, just two lots of lights, haven't I? But there's 60 of them, so it's not too bad, and they can fire while mounted, can't they? I'm not worried about anything else. I'm just going to leave it now and move on and see if I can get rid of the, um, the Swedes on this video, which I think should be eminently possible. Okay, and I might even get a little battle in there, like I said. It's going to be a long upload, this one, because I suspect this video is going to be an hour. I'm already up to 45 minutes, and... I don't think he's going to attack me. I don't think he's going to feel strong enough. So... Who's that? Give region... No, you're not getting anything. No one is getting anything out of me, thank you. Um, yeah, I was talking about Snowden. I, I can't quite work it out, what's happening with him, because... Um, I, I, I don't know if the Russians are bound by some kind of law. You know, I mean, we've had loads of, well, what they call Russian deserters. People are considered to be um, spies or, you know, infiltrators or something by the Russians. And um, the Americans just given protection to them. Um, d presumably, the Russians would consider them to be criminals. Um, in the same way that the Americans now consider the Snowden to be a criminal. So I, d I don't quite know how all this works, really. But anyway, um, call your allies to help. What's that? Oh, Inuits. No, I'm not going to. I, I wonder if they're the ones that are in range of Newfoundland. I don't want to lose Newfoundland, really, if I can help it. Now, where's he going? Right, well, the Inuits didn't seem to move anywhere, or I just wasn't paying any attention. I don't know. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, actually, I didn't look at what the Hanoverians are doing, did I? They might be causing me problems. I didn't. I should have tried to make peace with them. Why didn't I try to get peace with the Hanoverians? Um, and my worry is that they might be within range of one of my um, victory regions, one of my target regions. Okay, that's one turn that the Swedes have had um, sieging me. Come on, what are you doing? Right, okay, path blocked. Which one's that? That's just these, is it? Shall we go and kill him? No, I don't think we will, actually. What I'll do is I'll just go and have a look, see what he's got up here. Huh. Oh, it's blocked. What was that, then? Another one. <laughs> okay, he's hoping to fight me off with clerics, is he? Right, okay. Uh, not clerics. Uh, you know what I mean. Uh, right. Oh, let's get him out of the way as well, shall we? In fact, I think these are going to be totally useless here soon. So I'm going to get them back. Um, I think they're going to be useless wherever I send them, actually. I'll just send them to a nice cold place. Norway somewhere. I don't know. How about up there, out of the way? Okay. Uh, these guys, we did say they couldn't reach, didn't we? Let's see what happens. No, they can't reach. What a blooming nuisance. Right, okay. Can you get anywhere near? <laughs> you can get near. Can't reach, you know. What? It's because there aren't any roads. That's what the problem is. Damn. Okay. You can catch up then. Well, not catch up. But actually, it does look like they're catching up, doesn't it? They seem to be getting nearer. Which is uh, quite extraordinary. See, not even the general can get much closer. He can get that close. But it doesn't matter, really, does it? Because um, we're going oh, to... Anyway, right, let's have a look at the other places. Um, over here, we can take this one out. Probably on auto-resolve or a demand surrender. Demand surrender. Refused. Auto-resolves. Got to be mine. Victory. Excellent. 
another territory is mine and here we go our infrastructure is all good excellent it's very accommodating of him wasn't it to uh, improve the infrastructure for me um, now I don't need to worry about churches here do I because they're all oh I do actually because they're Swedish yeah pleasure gardens no we don't have any problem with pleasure gardens thank you very much we're perfectly happy to keep those uh, what else have they got um, I think there's, there it is that's that other one there so if I bring my troops from here I think I'm just going to attack him there aren't I do I risk him doing something there is still a territory that I can't reach and it's that one there isn't it over there and because I can't reach that one I can't just risk all and attack this one uh huh he can't get there no one can get there blast okay um like I said I was hoping to do all this on this one video but it's contriving against me at the moment um Dear. I think maybe he's moved the army from the bridge, is he? Is that what's happened? It was there, wasn't it? That one. Okay, well, I can't reach him up there. I can reach him from here, but would I be able to reach him and have enough to defend this? I've got fortifications. I can take him out there, but would I then be able to defend here. I think I've got to wait one more turn, you know. Um, yeah, I've got to wait one more turn and then take out that place and this place both at one time, unless he can get there. No, he can't get anywhere near. No, unfortunately it's going to be another turn before the Swedes are completely out of this game. I don't think I need to... Oh, I, I'll just make peace to the Hanoverians, I think. No, minor nation. Hanover. Open negotiation. I request peace. Request trade agreement. And I think that should do it, shouldn't it? Send proposal. I was thinking about it. Rarely have they been so insulted. Right, OK. Um, request peace. Um, I'm not going to give them a trade agreement this time. I'll give them some technology. <laughs> Let's give you national debt. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, little do you know where that's going to lead you <laughs> to in the future. Uh, regional capital. Um, oh, region captured, rather. Yeah, okay. Well, we know about all the ones we've captured. Trade gained, trade gained. What's this? Recruitment report. Yeah, thank you very much. You found them in all those other areas. Construction report. Yeah, thank you very much. All very good. I don't think I'm even going to bother building these new places um, where the churches should be, etc. Um, hang on. Something blocked me. And I don't know where I am now. But anyway, presumably I've moved it. So let's have a quick look over here. Just to make sure Newfoundland and those other areas are not at risk. No, we don't seem to be at risk. And I am recruiting in there. I recruited another one, if you remember. One that would take two turns. So I'm not worried there either. So, OK, maybe he can take that eventually. But am I worried? I don't think so. Right, OK, look at all those. Um, I, d I don't know whether to just rocket some Indians. <laughs> Maybe I should. Recruitment? No. I don't know really. Do I just go for the Indians? Maybe I should. I could certainly bring these out of here and just leave four behind to defend it because I think we do. Yes, we do have our fortifications in place. I'll get that as well. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Um, what does it allow me to have, actually? Um, uh General's bodyguard, household cavalry, but I've got too many of them already. I don't know. Maybe it allows me to get more troops. I've got so much money. Do I care? Right, OK, so these from here. I think I've got a general in here, haven't I? Yes. And I've got 11 units in there as well. So <coughs> if I put another nine in there, which is going to be, I don't know, those nine, maybe? No, not those nine. Uh, do I? I think I've got a horse in here, haven't I? I've got two lots of horses, so I don't need those. Yeah, so I'll give them those. 
Yeah. Okay. And then recruit some more in here. Uh, what infantry to defend the place? Mortars? No. Another puckle gun. They're fun, aren't they? And perhaps another horse. And maybe some grenadiers. They probably fight Indians well, won't they? Yeah, I would think so. The good melee troops. <coughs> Just throwing money at this now, aren't I? Who cares? Yeah, letting it go with abandon. What about this? Let's get that as well because maybe it'll give me a missionary and I can use that missionary to expose where his troops are. So, okay, that's about it, isn't it? What about the one that was down here where the Russians were? Maybe I should be moving him up into action. Um, I don't know. He's near enough to a port, isn't he? Maybe that's why he moved his troops over, you know. Because he knew I was moving those to there. Um, right, OK. Well, I can't see him being able to do anything successfully. So... Oh, did I move those guns into that Russian place so that the Swedes could all attack with their guns with them all in one? Do you remember they were within one turn? Hmm. Where's he going? Nowhere useful. In fact, it looks to me as though he's abandoning. Is it where on earth is he going? I don't know. What does he think he's over there that he can defend? That's bizarre, isn't it? He's well thrown the game basically. What's he doing? Gonna go and hide in the frozen waste somewhere and build igloos. Um, it'll be interesting to see if he attacks that, that building, doesn't it? But I think you do all your infantry first and then you move your agent. So I think this means that all his infantry movements are over. So all his infantry are about to disappear when I auto-resolve the attacks on those two regions that I now know that I'm in reach of. Uh, the Indians are just going to raid, I think. Am I bothered? OK. Military access indefinite and military alliance. For £60,000... Will you get lost? £60,000? Well, not pounds, but you know what I mean. Let's call them Remelias. 60,000 Remelias. Remelia sounds good, doesn't it? I think it's a good, a good coinage, really. Remelia. In fact, it sounds so good that I think it might well have been a coin at one stage. It should have been, shouldn't it? Hmm. I wonder what the change would be for Romelias. Oh, I know. Wallachias. No, Wallachia sounds better, doesn't it? You know, so many Romelias make a Wallachia, I would say. Don't you? That sounds good, doesn't it? Do you know what I mean? I mean, you, you buy a car in Wallachias, don't you? You know, you, you buy cigarettes in Romelias. You know, that sort of thing. Not that I buy cigarettes, by the way. Intelligent, intellectual advance, classical economics, and we're getting mass production next. Excellent! Aha! I'd forgotten about that, actually. Um, trait gained, thank you, I think. Uh, recruitment report, yeah, very good, all in Newfoundland, etc. Fleet arrives, ah, <laughs> well, that's those ships that I captured a long time ago. I think they were Swedish, weren't they? It's not going to let me have them, though. <laughs> it doesn't want me to have those ships. Oh, come on. Please let me have those ships. Come on. Right. OK, good. It had to think about that, didn't it? I don't know why, but it had to think. Right, I want to see who's in there. America. And they've got lots and lots of ships in here, but I haven't got anybody to defend them in here, you know. So if the Americans get a bit uppity... Oh, I have! I've got these galleons, haven't I? So let's see what sort of ships the Americans have got in here. He's got brigs. He's got a brig and a... Th what's that? A third rate and a brig. This is a weak point for me, you know. I might need to do something about that. OK. Uh, roads. Trait gained. Excellent. Thank you very much. And back over to here. Just have a quick check. I uh, really don't think I need to do anything. So many guys there. I can just go and attack him. Actually, does he control... He controls that area. That's why I can't get through. <laughs> well... If I can get all that way, I'm pretty sure along a road, or road types, I can get that way. So, I'm not worried. Anyway, okay, recruit more in here. Why not? 
recruitment one yeah we're gonna get some of those as well two three um, more of those um, and then more rockets four because I'm sure the Indians won't like rockets will they more puckle guns they're fun aren't they okay no not if they're gonna take two turns I'm not gonna faff about with that right let's have a quick look over here just to make sure that nobody if I could have just gone in there and taken that place couldn't I maybe I should have done well that um, Grand Columbia, I know they said Grand Canaria again, um, seems fairly safe, doesn't it? Oh, shall I get that in there as well? Yeah. Oh, I haven't upgraded the roads. And let's upgrade that as well, actually. Very good. Right, now let's see if we can now finally, more than an hour it's taken, let's see if we can finally wipe out the Swedes. Uh, please don't tell me there's another area that I've missed somewhere. So those to there. That's his capital, of course. So continue siege on that one and bring these guys up here. How long does it take in this final part of this Swedish campaign? Three, four turns? I'm not too sure. I'm losing count. Um, but I think if I... Yeah, they, they're they the ones I should have moved up. But anyway, didn't. So that's the way it is. So, right. One, oh, no. The stuff, no, that's mine. So when I take these two territories, that's the end of the Swedes. I'm just going to double check it. Okay, Swedes, Sweden, open negotiation, regions, one region plus a capital. Excellent. So that's the end of the Swedes then, isn't it? So if I move into here, which isn't his capital. Okay, maintain siege on there. And... They, can they go anywhere useful? Well, they can eventually. Do I want them all the way in the centre of Russia here if I don't need them? Oh, well, why not? We're nearly there anyway, aren't we? So, OK, over to there. Now. OK, that's not the capital, is it? No, it's the one at the top that's the capital. So, demand surrender. I thought so. Excellent. And that one there. Uh, oh, everything else is good. Is it still orthodox? I doubt it. Um, oh, College of Divinity. What's that one then? That Protestant. Damn, I've got to change all of these then. Um, come on, where are you? Right, OK, you've got to go. And uh, you've got to go. And... You've got to go. That's three. And you've got to go. That's four. All gone. Excellent. Okay, good. And looking over here at the top, we've got. Yeah, I knew he wouldn't attack there. Doesn't make any sense for him to do it, does it? And over here, he can't. Um, Surrender, can he? Because it's his capital and he'd be out of the game. So, re surrender refused. That's well in my favour. Surely I'm not going to lose this one. If I lose this one, I'll stamp my feet. But I am on 957 versus 900, aren't I? I can't risk it, you know. I have to shell him with my artillery. What a pain. 957 versus 900, even though it's in my favour. Dare I risk it? Oh, fingers crossed. No, Oof. Oh, crikey. <laughs> With it being the last area and, and all that, you know, it's just it's such a heart in mouth thing. But I, I just wanted to get rid of the Swedes completely. And that is what we've achieved on this video. Finally, region captured. Yeah, thank you very much. Region captured, region captured. Thank you very much. Good. Just while I remember, though, I am going to repair this place. Um, otherwise I might just forget completely all about it. The infrastructure is good in all these, which is great. It's good that I left these till the end then, isn't it, really, to get to, because the roads are better. So, nothing else really to get from there. And in fact, these places that I've just taken might add so much to the trade. Look at that. I'm on almost 50,000 with all these massive armies I've got everywhere, haven't I? So, aren't I? So, right, OK, um, Poles, Prussians. I've got three years left, which is... 
12 turns probably I think I can do that don't you I would imagine it would be easy but so that would give me the whole of um, Europe if I were to do that the whole of India which I've already got and of course um, I, the whole well not the whole of South America no but whatever I lose or win in America it makes no difference because they're not target areas are they Anyway, um, like I said, next, well, I say we're going to earn loads of money. I've got, I've got loads of money. We're going to earn loads of money. Um, we've actually got, what have we got? 130,000 Wallachias and 51 Remelias. Wow, that's amazing, isn't it? <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, folks.